We've got some water boiling here. We're putting in two skinless breasts of chicken. I love chicken soup. When I was a kid, my mum used to make it for me when I was feeling poorly, and it always used to make me feel really great again. And did the same thing for me when I was going through chemo. So it's a perfect thing for anyone who's feeling under the weather. We need carrots and celery, which are just roughly cut up. This is a shallot, we're going to stick it with some cloves. These just give a fantastic taste to the broth, it's really great. And a couple of bay leaves, like so, and peppercorns perhaps. That's about a teaspoon, those can go into, and a pinch of salt. All we've got to do now is wait for the chicken to cook, and that'll take about 25 minutes. Now we're going to make the soup base. Turn the heat up to medium high, a bit of olive oil, some onion, carrots, diced again, all about the same size. It's real important to have things the same size so that they cook evenly and quickly. Some celery. Ah, oh, that's music to my ears, it's sizzling now. And these little Yukon gold potatoes hold their shape. Now our broth in the back is boiling like crazy, so we're going to turn that down. The onions are just about transparent. So we're going to partially cover, turn the heat down to low, and then we're going to let the vegetables just stew a little bit. The vegetables now are pretty much ready. So I'm going to put a couple of ladlefuls into there. I'm going to leave this now to simmer a little bit while we shred the chicken. See how nice they look? We've just got to cut as much as we can of it off the bone. See, it just pulls apart. And we're just going to put it in the soup. Nothing really too hard about this, right? I'm going to strain the broth into the soup. So, now we're going to put the dill into it. It's always good with fresh herbs to put them in right at the end so they keep all the flavor. Okay. And voila, it's done. Let's eat.